Amanda Martinez with Hollywood First Look, and today I'm chatting with the cast of The Garcias. Let's take a first look. Maybe we could have it just a little while longer here. We can enjoy some sunsets, you can finish your book, and besides, maybe it's time I actually retired. It's gonna be a terrific two months. Two months? What? In life, we meet lots of really different characters. None more unique and interesting than the characters that make up what we call our family. I just love seeing this. Uh, Jeffrey, we'll start with you. What was it like to come back to this? It was just a complete dream. Um, I, I had such an amazing and and unique experience. Um, you know, filming the original that when it, this even came, there was talks about it. I, I, I couldn't help but just get excited. You know, it was it was that great. When we had the original uh, cast, we were a very close knit bunch and it really did feel like family. I would call Ada Maris, who plays my mother, and Carlos the camera, who plays my father. I would call them mom and dad and I still do. So when I saw them, you know, 20 years later for the first time in person again, I immediately just went up to them like mom, dad, give them a big hug. Um, Carlos still calls me son in a very, like, funny way. He's just a, a goofy. He'll be like, son, come here. Um, and so when, the, you know, when we had the, the new cast coming in, I, I had some concerns. I was like, we're bringing all these new people. Maybe personalities won't mesh. But I, I had no reason to worry. Uh, for anybody who loves on-set drama, this is, un unfortunately, will be very disappointed. Uh, there were no fights. There, like, everyone... Uh, I mean, as soon as everybody came together, we realized we all had the same goals in mind. We were all incredibly committed to the message of the show and, and pushing forward the right kind of representation. And so, you know, this new family just became family as well. What was it about this role that you're like, oh, I have to play this? You know, I just love that she is, for one, not your stereotypical Asian mom. I love that about her. She's not like concerned with, you know, get A's and become a doctor or a lawyer. And she really embraces the artist uh, side of Alexa. And then also with Ava, I feel like she doesn't fully understand the science side, but she still embraces her and supports her in that. I love that Alexa is an artist and expresses herself freely through art. Um, and she's an observer and if, like me, she, family is the most important thing to her. Um, and it was such an honor to play Alexa. and. Alexa is a mixed race girl and grew up in a mixed race family just like me. So I feel like I could really relate to that and I'm so glad that people get to see that. I'm really feeling the feels of mi gente, the people of Mexico. George, you know you're half Puerto Rican. Yeah. While no one is ever quite certain where the path they're on will lead, with the support and love of those around you, it's always more about the journey. Oh, Chapulines. The Mexican popcorn, and they're extra spicy. <laughs> but you know, it doesn't have much. Oh, okay, it's just, yeah, that's got a kick. What was it like for you to join the family and then to be filming in Mexico? How fun! When you read something different and something bright and something positive and something that really represents you in the best way that uh, you can show that, oh, no, this is us. We are more than the kind of uh, stuff that you see on television, uh, especially because Jeff Valdez is uh, Mexican-American. So he really understands that we are not only drug dealers or this or that or the immigrants that come and do and like uh, break the laws. We are like much, much more than that. So I didn't grow up here. I'm from Mexico, 100%. I moved to the States eight years ago. So it was a big challenge for me to do my first uh, show in English. So for me, it was like, oh my God, like this is huge. How am I going to do it? But Bobby, like he helped me a lot. He is the most amazing and loving person on earth I can tell you and the cast like everyone was so supportive they like knew that it was my first show in English and imagine like getting like the opportunity to go to Mexico and to represent the best way that we can do it it was just amazing you know it definitely was a summer vacation it was it was you know you're filming in one of the most beautiful places you could ever imagine a 5 36 a.m call time to be put in hair and makeup and be mic'd up and everything 
doesn't seem that bad when you're like pulling into this mansion that's on the beach and the sun is rising and it's like wonderful. Um, so yeah, I mean, it definitely was a summer vacation, but we did work like memorizing lines and rehearsing and stuff is like, we put in the time. So mm-hmm. the two days off that we had a week was well worth it. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. The Garcias is now streaming on HBO Max. My name's Amy Cassandra Martinez and I'll see you guys next time. I'm just trying to save the world that your generation has been so good at destroying. Are you in or out? <gasps> oh, that smell of peroxide. It's like I'm back in the game. As we say in Mexico, al mal tiempo, buena cara. That doesn't even make sense.